Hi, my name is Sarah Hellwig, and today I'm going to teach you how to make a Kahoot. So you want to start off by going to your internet browser. You can use Google Chrome, Microsoft Edge, or Safari, whatever you have. I'm going to use Google Chrome. So you want to type in the URL, kahoot.com, and go. So you can either sign up or log in, depending on whether or not you have a Kahoot account. I have one, so I'm going to log in. So now that you've logged in or created your account, you can go straight here to create a new Kahoot. There are a couple options. There's a quiz, a jumble, a discussion, and a survey. Each one can be used for many different reasons in your classroom, but today I'm going to show you how to make a survey. So once you click on it, you're taken to this page, which has many different options. So you want to start by making a title. I'm going to make mine something simple, like favorite color. Then you want to go down to description and write a description that describes what your Kahoot is all about. Then if you scroll down, you'll see a couple of different options. So visible to is whether you want to make your Kahoot private or not. Language, there's many to choose from. And audience, I picked school. So if you use any resources like for an image or in your description, you want to credit them here. And if you want to use an intro video through YouTube, you can just copy and paste the URL right there and then hit OK, go. So now we're going to add some questions. My first question is going to be simply, but you can make it whatever you like. And then you want to go down here and set a time limit for your question and give them some answers. And again, if you use an image or a YouTube video or something in your answers, you want to credit your resources right here. Then you hit next and you can add as many questions as you like. You can go up here and you can edit your coat description. You can edit your questions and you can even drag them around if you have multiple questions. So you have an order of which they're in. And when you're finished, you hit save. And now you're given some options. You can edit it, preview it, play it, or share it. I'm going to hit that I'm done. And now you're taken to your page where you have all your cahoots. You can hit here to create a new one, or you can hit here to edit, preview, share, duplicate, delete this one, um, or you can just play it. Then you're taken to this screen where you can choose some options for your game classic or team mode, and you can play your game with your class. So that's how you make a Kahoot, and thanks for watching my video.